Hello Pacific Northwest Conference, this is Eric Cave, your Director of Next Gen Ministries. I wish that we were all together at Cascades Camp for Thunder 2020. That's just not in the cards because of COVID-19 and the quarantine. This is a really difficult time of ministry, but I want you to know that I'm proud of each of you because of the faithfulness you've shown to your church, to your families, and to your students. You might not see it, but I know that you are making a difference. I want to say thank you to our planning team. Rand Fenton, Mark Neely, and Matt Knapp have all sacrificed time and energy in order to put this together. And it has been a blast working with them. We're going to explore our theme of Once Upon a Thunder by unpacking our key verse through the lens of the hero's journey. Britta was going to help us see that we don't need to be controlled by fear. Ruby is going to show us that the power of God is available for us right now. Matt is going to teach us about our motivation that comes through the love of Christ. And Mark's going to wrap it all up by showing us how to live with clear minds. We set out to create a resource that is quality, plug and play, customizable, and connects with past thunders. The Leader's guy will lay out everything you need in order to plan your retreat, whether it's virtual, or in-person or a hybrid of the two. The small group leader guide will give you the tools you need to discuss the map passages and the messages well. And our activity guides will give you plans for upfront games, afternoon activities, with special attention to virtual or online meetings. Please let us know when you plan to use this material. The entire planning team is making themselves available for consultation to help you lead your retreat and to pray. And I want to personally make myself available because I would love to join you for anything that you are able to do face to face. So on behalf of Brianne, Mark, Matt, Britta, and Ruby, I want to wish you well as you plan your own Thunder 2020. Now may the Lord bless you and keep you. May his face shine upon you and give you peace as you serve him.